Hope you're enjoying your weekend. Thanks for taking a moment out of it to pause and to um, listen to this prayer and to pray with me. We're wrapping up our thoughts on expectations and setting realistic expectations, especially in our relationships with others. And we're looking at 1 Corinthians 13. Paul writes, when I was a child, I used to talk as a child, think as a child, reason as a child. When I became a man, I put aside childish things. So faith, hope, love remain, these three. But the greatest of these is love. So Paul talks about moving to maturity. And maturity, again, realizes that as children, again, we, we put unrealistic expectations on people. We expect the world to revolve around us. You know, it's a, the childish way of thinking. Mature people, again, realize that um, people will let us down at times, that our expectations for people is not the center of the universe, right? We are not the center. God is the center, and so we can't make our expectations for people the center of the universe. And that at the ultimate, ultimately, the greatest choice we have is to love others. So let's pray for the grace to grow in the maturity, to grow into maturity that loves people even when they don't meet our expectations. Heavenly Father, we thank you for these awesome words from Paul, as challenging as they are. And God, we pray, first of all, God, we repent. We repent of the times in which we make our expectations for people uh, the center of the world, as if the world should revolve around us. God, we know that you are the center of the world. So God, help us to grow to maturity, to a place where we put away our childish expectations for people that are not grounded in reality. And God, help us to grow in faith, hope, and love, but especially in love for others. We pray this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Thank you for participating in our daily practice. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a single video. You can be part of our mission to love God, love others, and make disciples by sharing this video. We're grateful you're part of this community.